Welcome back for the final episode of Hero Quest. Uh, the quest we're doing is the trial. Um, so basically, where we left off, our heroes here are hanging out in this room, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna go backtrack through here, this quarter, and kind of just see what's going on over there. Um, if you remember, we cannot get through this right here. The wall's blocked. I'm gonna go that way. We'll find out what's over there. All right, let's move some dice. All right, here we go. All right, ooh, 11. Two, two, four, five, six, seven. And he's looking down. All right, we're gonna look down this way. Let me see, ooh, door. Right there. All right, we roll 11, big left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah. We do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, here we go. We're getting into this nitty gritty now. Barbarian at the door. Open store. What does he see in there? We're gonna look, and we got, uh, what is that, bookshelf. We got another bookshelf, we got two bookshelves in there. The one right here, or actually a cabinet, and a bookshelf right here. Also, a treasure chest, where's that thing? Oh, it's right over here, so the treasure chest. It's kinda nestled over here in the corner, let me see. corner there. Look at this. And you can just tell the way this game is just... Look at this. Everything's opened up, getting pieces on the board. Man, it just looks really cool. Okay, oh, monsters. Oh, what is that thing? We got... Ha! Two Chaos Warriors. This will be interesting, for sure. One guy is going to be right over here. The other guy, he is actually right here. Now, the Chaos Warrior is a beast. Look at this. Four attack dice, four defend. Yeah, that's not pleasant. <laughs> it will cut out for me. Um, let me see what we want to do here. So, I'm going to sit tight. I'm going to let the mage move in behind me. And I am going to uh, let them come to me. Now, being I'm only playing with two players, this is probably the, the, the best thing to do. If you're, I was playing with, with a full onslaught of four, more support characters, yeah, I'd, I'd rush right in there and start swinging away with my big broadsword, but I don't have that luxury. So I'm going to sit tight. A Chaos Warrior, he moves seven. That's not a problem for him to move his all two to get right here and swing away with four. Four attack dice. Here we go. Hits me for one. I get to defend with two. And he does. Now it's my turn. I hit him for two. Alright, that ain't bad. So he gets uh, four defend dice. And he doesn't defend. Awesome. He has one hit point left, and it's his turn. There you go. Ooh, hits me for one. I get to defend, though. I block. My turn. Hit him for the uh, one. He gets four to block. He blocks. Wizard, uh, what's the wizard gonna do? Wizard's not gonna do anything, he's gonna sit tight. He can just hold his ground there. Let's see. Um, Alright, Chaos Warrior's turn. Ugh, hits me for two. Let's see if I can defend that. Oh, the gods are smiling upon the Barbarian. Blocks both. Alright, back to the Barbarian. Now he's just angry. He wants to end this once and for all. 
Hits him for two. One block, two, you have one hit point left. He's dead. You, sir, are no more. All right, so Wizzy just gonna sit tight again. I'm gonna wait for the other guy to come up, and he will. He's not very pleasant looking. Let's, uh, hits me for one. Yeah, let me look at defend that. And I do. Bam. My turn. And this guy. My turn. And this guy. Alright, hit him for two. That ain't bad. He gets his four defense. Alright, so he gets one off. He blocked one. Alright, he has two hit points left, and it's his turn, and he's not happy. Hits me for one. I don't block that. I do. And my turn. Here we go. End him. He has two hit points. And there's the two hit points. This is not that. Alright, so he has a chance to block. Chance to block. He blocks one. All right, so he has one hit point left. Ooh, it's getting down to the toe and toe here. And it's his turn. Chaos Warrior for Oh, look at this. <laughs> Critical miss. All right. There it is, two. So he has four to block. He only had one hit point left. Boom, he's dead. Alright, so he's gone. Room's cleared out. There's a treasure chest in there. Let's check it out. He's in. Barbarian in. Wizard in. And the wizard is gonna check the room. Oh, guess what? Uh, this <laughs> The treasure chest is empty. That's what I get. Bam. Look at this. B. Treasure chest is empty. Alright, that was a waste. Alright, so let's move on over. Adventure the rest of this dungeon. Alright, big roll. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's looking that way. Guess what? He sees. He sees this area is blocked right here, but he sees a door right there. Uh, now, wizard, big roll, two, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now he's right here. Argon, not moving. There we go. Ah, this is gonna get you know this is gonna get nerve wracking in here. Let's open that door and see what's inside, shall we? Well, what's inside is ooh, look at this fireplace, big hearth, There's another table. There. Oh, a throne? I see a throne in there. That's crazy. What is this? Oh, and another treasure chest. That's oh, right there. Oh, man. Let's see. Looks like we got a gargoyle. Let's get this guy seems looking. Uh, orc. Another orc. And a chaos warrior. 
All right. Wow. That's serious. That is truly serious right here. Take a look here. We got this. All right. So let's figure out what we're going to do here. Oh, it turns over. Moved. Hmm. All right. I'm going to wait right here at the door and let them come to me. Orc is going to be the first one up. Let's see what he does. Big Orc. Let's see here. We got the Orc in there. Got the Gargoyle. The Chaos Warrior. Here's the Gargoyle. Look at this guy. Four or five. Three hit points. All right, but the orc. We're gonna take out the orc. Orc's hit swinging at me for three. Hits me for one. All right, so I'm gonna block, and I do. Bam. All right. What do we got? What's this mess gonna do now? Dude, they're gonna they're gonna stand put. They don't really don't need to filter into the door. They're just gonna chill out. I think what Zargon would do it. He would want to bring in the warriors to the advantage point instead of going to a choke point. So they're gonna chill out. Warriors turn. All right, hits two points of damage. Orc gets two defenders. Misses. Guess what? Cleaning them out. Cleaning them out. Boom. Works down. All right, I get to move. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I think the barbarians in there are just gonna bum rush the room. Let's see what we got here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go after that chaos warrior. Go toe to toe with him right here. Now check this out. The wizard. This is why I'm doing this. The wizard. Of course, he rolled a 12. He's going to come in right here, line of sight. He's going to try to put the gargoyle to sleep. That's that's what we need to do. All right, sleep spell. All right, uh, rolls a six. The spell's broken. He gets to roll one red die. So every, it looks like a future turn. So every turn, the gargoyle gets to roll one red dice. All right, so we're going to put the gargoyle to sleep. Now, gargoyle gets to roll a defense dice to see. He needs to roll a, where is that sleep spell? A six, so every turn he, he does a check to see if he stays asleep. Right now I'm gonna put him to sleep. Yeah, it's three, gargoyle asleep. Okay, now let's focus over here. Our, we've uh, moved, so Chaos Warrior, it will be moving now, so he's going to try to attack me. And the Chaos Warrior gets huh, four attack dice, that's great. I forgot about that. So, here we go. Big attack. Boom. Guess what? Eh, big miss. Alright, but what's over here? right here. Orc can't reach me. Nope. So, actually, I think he can go through his buddy. So he's gonna come over around over here. And he's gonna he's gonna bash my face in with that. Was that a Morning Star? Maybe. So here we go. Uh, the orc. The good old orc. Three. Ooh, he hit me for one. E. And I defend it. Thank God. All right. Uh, Gargo, it makes a check. He's still asleep. All right, so now, my turn. So what I'm going to do is I got this potion of defense. Uh, this potion of defense. I'm probably going to need it. Remember I got this? So... Let's see, you can drink the potion, gives me two extra combat dice the next time you defend. That's, I'm gonna need that. I'm definitely gonna need that. I think I got something else too here. Uh, I don't need 
those. All right, so Barbarian is going to swing on the Chaos Warrior. Come on, here we go, let's get the tail of the tape. Two hit point, two damage, I sent his way to the Gargoyle. Or not the Gargoyle, I'm sorry, the Chaos Warrior. Chaos Warrior gets two, four defense dice. Ah, he gets one. Boom. Two hit points left. Mage is gonna go. Mage, mage, mage. Mage is going to. What is he gonna do? Um, I think I am going to blast. Need a ball of flame here. This will inflict two points of damage. I'm gonna get rid of it. Orc. Actually, you know what? Should I, maybe I should save that. I don't think I have any more. Yeah, I'm gonna save that for the gargoyle, but I don't wanna. If I hit the gargoyle, it will break his sleep. I don't wanna do that. Um, I think I'm okay. So, what he's gonna do is he's gonna move. Yeah, he's gonna move. And he's gonna use his one little dagger swing here and hit the York because the York only has one hit point. Hits him. Look at that. Work. To defense. Nope. Guess what? Work is out of here. By the dagger. Alright. Chaos Warrior's turn. He has all uh, one hit point left. But he's going to make do with that. He's going to come at me big. Hits me for two. Oh boy. Alright, so I got a chance to defend that. Got one. So, puts me six hit points. Alright, so, huge battle. So we have, let's see if the gargoyle is still asleep. And he is. He's snoozing away. Alright, now I gotta finish this Chaos Warrior off once and for all. And for one. Ah, miss. Does not defend himself. Okay, this warrior's down. <coughs> Alright, so now let's take out the main guy here. So we take a look. Yeah. It's getting silly now. We're gonna all move in on him. So, where's the, uh, put me, I'm gonna put my guy right next to him, here, mage, it's gonna go right here, actually, you know what, the mage is gonna go, uh, he's gonna swing all the way around and put himself next to the gargoyle. Still snoozing away. Let's wake him up from his sleep with two hit points coming his way. He gets to defend with, oh man, he's like five dice. Yep, he blocked one. No, he blocked one right there. All right, so, boom, gargoyle. Three hit points, now he's down to two. Uh, so, I'm gonna cast Ball of Flame on him. Two body points. Demonstra can roll two red dice. So, five and six. Come on. Oh, he gets one point of damage from that. Guess what? Gargoyle is down to one point of damage. Alright, now if we look. go. One point of damage. And it's his turn. Gargoyle. He's going to swing away on the warrior. He gets to swing. Four attack dice. He hits me for two. 
but I get to roll an additional two attack dice myself, so I get four because I drink that potion of defense. I block for two. So this turn is going. Now, I'm going to swing away and end this guy with one hit point. Look at that. Three. He needs a big defense. He doesn't get it. Guess what? We win. Let's get out of here. Alright. So, what did we win? We're gonna search the room, obviously. We got 120 gold for searching this room. That's a nice purse. But, it's not over. We didn't win, we didn't win yet. We need to get out of here. All the way here, run around. And boom, gotta get to those stairs. That's when you win the game. Obviously though, it shouldn't be a big deal. I'm not gonna sit here and constantly rolling the dice to watch me get out, because I will. There's no other monsters to chase us. Something like that is uh, basically if we, you know, um, you can run around and like, this is, again, this is just the, um, you know, just to figure out the mechanics of the game. Um, you know, this is real simple stuff and to show you how just to, you know, how you can work with a team. Obviously, I just, I just picked two players here. Uh, they get through it. Um, it's really difficult playing with two people. So there was times where I, I probably should have been dead, but uh, you know uh, I had to ma I manipulated the dice a little bit to show you that uh, just so I can continue to play. Um, I had a really fun time playing this game. Uh, this is a fantastic game. I think this game came out what in '89, '90, somewhere around there, and and it still is right up there. It, it holds its own, has a lot of fantastic little pieces and things because you could tell you're just really like building the dungeon as you're going. So, um, really, really happy with this game. And um, I think that it would be, uh, you know, something that uh, you can play uh, years to come. Um, I hope you had as much fun as uh, watching as I did playing. Uh, stay tuned for uh, next time. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe.